After 50 years of development, seamlessly passing our March 31st deadline, I'm here to show you our most exciting new product ever. Developed to bring comprehensive understanding to the marvelously conceived Turbo Encabulator. Now, student activities were artificially sacrificed at a remote location to prove inverse reactive curriculum through a gamified learning management system. Special learning tools have been developed for using unilateral phase apprentices, but would also be capable of automatically synchronizing cardinal STEM programs. Such a product is a new EM122 TE Turbo Encabulator Simulator. Now, if you've been teaching encabulators for a while, you'll know that the only new principle involved is that instead of power being generated by the relative motion of conductors and fluxes, it is produced by the modal interaction of magnetoreluctance and capacitive directance. Now, normally, this would be easy to teach, but in a turbo encabulator, the process runs longitudinally and the students are unable to data log the 710 pressure. We have circumnavigated the CL1969 network and finally developed a way for your students to visually see the base plate of pre-famulated amulite. Now, contrary to our competitors, our product maintains its logarithmic casing in such a way that the two spurving bearings remain in a direct line with the Panamera fan. The Consolab product has been designed to teach all basic operating principles of the quick GMC Haggard General Eclectic, Chrysler, and Roxwell style encabulators. The six hydrocoptic Marzal veins have also been cut away, and we've so fitted a motor to the ambifacient lunar wane shaft to rotate it, demonstrating how side fumbling has been prevented. Here we can see the details of the Lotus O Delta main winding placed in panendermic semi boloid slots of the stator, every seventh conductor being connected by non reversible tremie pipe to the differential girdle spring on the up end of the gram meters. The EM122 TE is now available with correct teacher training, can operate in over trunnions. Moreover, based upon the findings of the Peruvian Academy of Scatological Sciences, whenever a Wierzbowski movement is required, it may also be employed in conjunction with the drawn reciprocation dingleberry arm to reduce sinusoidal replaneration. To find out more about our products, or to get an EM122 TE for your classroom, please visit consolab.com or follow us on Facebook, Twitter, or LinkedIn. We also offer training, both at our headquarters or remotely. Please note that as time progresses, some settling of our trainers may occur. Thanks for watching.